Alright, Allison Summers, everybody. How about that? Eddie? It's a good start. Are we doing alright? Alright, I'm nervous. Is that okay? Alright. Well, we'll be gentle. Alright, let's keep it professional. You don't even know me yet. Let's calm down. I, uh, I'm really frustrated. Uh, my neighbor has a package in front of his door right now. It's, uh, it's driving me fucking crazy right now. I don't, I don't want to steal it. I, I want to take it in so it doesn't get stolen. You know what I mean? You see the dilemma I'm in? I don't know my neighbor. He doesn't, his instinct's not going to be trust that guy. And fuck, it's been three days. It's like a weird amount of time. You know, it's a dangerous amount of time. Because maybe he just had a long weekend trip. Maybe he's on vacation. I can't risk it. I can't be mid picking up the box, taking it to my apartment. He's like, hey, what's up? And I'm like, ah, this is for you. <laughs> Kind of energy I give out, uh, I feel like it's like stepdad energy. <laughs> like I can't father my own children, but I'll raise someone else's. You know? <laughs> it's a pretty big flex to raise someone else's child. You know, it's finishing someone else's homework. It's a pretty big move. I, uh, I have made a lot of mistakes. <laughs> Said the guy on stage. I have made a lot of mistakes, uh, a lot of financial errors, if you will. But I do think about, like, the one plus side is, uh, I don't know, I just feel like no matter what, I never bought horse cum. <laughs> But, there is someone who that's a part of their financial history. I think it's weird how we treat animals, just certain ones, you know, like, what a weird life to be a racing horse. You don't know what's happening. For maybe three years, someone is just beating the shit out of you. And then just out of the blue, you just get put on a huge farm and jerked off every day. It's a weird retirement package, and I'm open to it. <laughs> Michael, you could have a 401k. Or <laughs> Susan will come to your house every morning and jack you off. Sounds good. <laughs> I'm married. Is anybody else in love? I'm in love. I love being married. Being married is uh, is weird. I waited a long time, and uh, my wife is eight years younger than me. Which is awesome. Until you tell people. And then just, everybody's got opinions. You know? I'm very fortunate. I think you have to get a little interesting in bed. Right? To keep it alive. You got a mustache. You know. I know. Right? You got to crawl around in there. Figure out some secrets. I do a new thing. With my wife now. I get in there, I start rooting around like a feral hog. Just, and I just, everything I can touch, I'm just putting it in my mouth. And that kind of loosens her up, you know, relaxes her. And I kind of like, you know, rolling her around like Play-Doh, just kind of like folding her on herself like a nice baking technique. Just, you gotta fold it within itself. You relax the muscles, you elongate the body. And then while I'm down there doing crucial mining, an opportunity, if you do it right, an opportunity will present itself to where 
the asshole will be very present. <laughs> and then you just... Do <laughs> you see what it was? You got it? To get real open. Real. If I wink at you. And it just, just a little one. Like it was a really good meal. You guys are fun. Huh? You're weird. I 